Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel where we showcase various DIY projects. Today, we are going to show you how to make an ESP32 CAM based object detection and identification system. This system uses OpenCV and a pre trained AI model to detect objects and identify them in real time. This system can be used in various industries for tracking objects, people counting, automated CCTV surveillance, vehicle detection, and more. Let's go through the list of materials you will need for this project. ESP32 CAM board, FTDI module, USB cable, Jumper wires First, we will connect the ESP32 CAM module to the FTDI module. Connect the 5 volt and GND pins of the ESP32 module to the 5 volt and GND pins of the FTDI module. Next, connect the RDX pin of the ESP32 module to the UOT pin of the FTDI module and the TX pin of the ESP32 module to the UOR pin of the FTDI module. Do you need a custom PCB for your next project? Check out our sponsor, PCBWay.com. Ordering a custom PCB is easy with PCBWay.com. Just upload your Garber files, choose your preferences, and let them handle the rest. They offer plenty of customization options, such as size, layers, solder max color, and surface finish. Their advanced facilities ensure top-notch manufacturing with quality control to ensure every board meets their high standards. Plus, they offer fast delivery at affordable pricing. So, you can get your custom PCBs quickly and without any hassle. Visit PCBWay.com today to order your custom PCBs and take your project to the next level. And don't forget to use the link in the description to get started. Installing the ESP32 CAM library To use the ESP32 CAM with OpenCV, we need to install an additional library called the ESP32 CAM library. Go to the GitHub link provided in the description and download the zip file. Add this zip library to your Arduino library folder. Open the Arduino IDE. Copy the code from the website link provided in the description and paste it in the IDE. Before uploading, change the SSID and password variables according to your Wi-Fi network. Sort the IO0 pin with the ground and press the upload button. If you see dots and dashes while uploading, press the reset button immediately. Once the code is uploaded, remove the IO0 pin shorting with the ground. Now, open the serial monitor and press the reset button once again. If everything works well, then you will see camera OK, text followed by an ESP32 CAMP IP address. Just copy it, we will need it in the Python code. To display the live stream of the video on your computer, we need to install Python and some required libraries. Download and install Python from python.org. Then, open the command prompt and install numpy, opencv, and cvlimp libraries using the following commands. pip install numpy. pip install opencv python. And pip install 
सीवी लीव एंड टेंस और फ्लो Open any Python code editor and copy the code from the website link provided in the description. Replace the IP address with the IP address shown in the Arduino IDE serial monitor. Run the Python code and you will be able to see the live stream with object detection in separate windows. And that's it for today. You have successfully built an ESP32 CAM based object detection and identification system. We hope you enjoyed the video and learned something new today. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more DIY projects. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.